Hi guys, it's Candace. Welcome back. Okay, so I joined this little challenge of Tommy Phillips, um, Think Outside the Box Challenge, and it's week one, Acetate. So she didn't clarify exactly what acetate is. I know man, my hands are so dry. This weather is crazy. I have, it's, it was freezing. Well, last week was cold. Then it was, you know, decent. And then, hello, some crazy storms coming through and it's 82 stinking degrees outside. So anyway, but we're supposed to be using acetate and not using the traditional window approach of an acetate. So I'm trying to do, I know, I'm sorry y'all. So I'm trying to do um, something different. I don't know. I haven't seen it before, but I'm, you know, duh. So I'm using these circles from Blossom Paper Art. And <coughs> I don't even know how big these are. If I even have a punch that size, almost two. So, well, we're going to have to use our two inches and see how that goes. Then this is my acetate that I'm using, a bag. And I just, I just smeared my, my greasy mug mug prints all over them well we'll have to wipe it in a, in a minute after all my my fingers dry you know i don't even know why i bother wearing this shirt i know wham 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 all the way home wham, 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 wham. the sleeves are too long they're too big when they're down they you know anyway so let me pull them up so this is my stamp little punch that i'm using from martha stewart and um so i'm punching this because i want to use these on the side and then I have this to make sure this is how big my, my page is going to be. So what I'm doing, I know I'm going to stick with these kind of funky-ish, bluey, tealy, some kind of this shade blue. Because there's a lady at John's Chemo that was getting um, chemo and she was journaling. So of course, me being the quiet little mouse person I am had to go over there and said, oh, you're a journaler? She's like, yeah, I'm just writing a story that I had started um, a couple years ago. And she says, I figured now is the time to, to finish it. So I was like, well, I make journals. I said, can I make a journal for you? And she's like, oh my God, that would be so nice. That's so sweet. So I'm making a journal for this lady who I don't even know, but it looks like she's going maybe breast cancer. I didn't ask because you know you're not supposed to ask those things in there. But um but she's you know was you know and I hate that people come alone. You know, where is your support group? But then again her support group could have been sitting outside in the car in the parking lot lot like John's support group has to because there's no place for you to sit in there. But anyway <laughs> back to the thing at hand. So I'm gonna try to put together a journal for her just because oops wrong way don't break it Candace Lord all right Jeez, if y'all could see I'm telling you it's so bad this is so messy it's horrible all right let me throw all these in the trash can all right and then I'm cutting this I'm trimming this off at on here at seven eighths of an inch I believe that's what the other one was. So we're trying to. Oh, I didn't even cut that one all the way the right way. Oh, dummy Candace. Well, anyway, I just put in the punch a little different. So we'll have to see what we can do with that. But the colors are not really this and it's not. Well, it is more this. Cause she had a shirt on because you know i'm like well what's your favorite color and stuff and her shirt was kind of this color but i, I thought this would be too and eh, i needed the the i don't know so that's why i'm using that color well, heck let me keep that out no point putting that in there because <coughs> i'm probably gonna use it all right so let me see I know i'm kind of i was leaning towards this group here so let's just well let's just cut them Cut them with a ruler. Oh, and then see even here. <laughs> I haven't put any of my crap up here. And there's just not room. I know. I'm in denial. <laughs> what can I say? Oh, I decided who'd I want this one. 
because I've got a couple butterfly things in there, but that one's butterfly too. But I'm wanting that color, I believe. I don't know. I don't know. We might end up making two because I'm not quite sure. All right, I just want to try to keep the name on here so I don't forget who the heck this kid is. Because you know I will. Oh. All right. So now, let me set that bad boy aside and get my little two-inch hole puncher and use my right hand so we don't have problems. No guarantees. Yes, yeah, so. Oh. Stink buckets. Yeah, so John went down to the gate because, you know, well, first the gate was broken. It wouldn't open. Well, now we the ghost gate is back. It doesn't stay closed. So he's down there trying to figure out what is wrong with it. So, I mean, I'll go outside and I'm like, oh my God. And he said, what? I said, the gate's open again. He's like, no way. There's no way that gate's open. He goes out there, looks on the porch. Oh, the gate's open. I'm not making up stories. <laughs> I mean, hello. Why would I lie about the gate being open? So anyway, so I'm thinking after his last repair, um, he must not have shut the battery box well because that's what that's what caused it to ha be the ghost gate last time was water had got down inside the battery and we had that bad storm oh shoot i think friday night i don't know i don't remember my days anymore and there's a good possibility that water got down in the thing because you know he thinks if you just clear silicone everything it fixes it all clear silicone and duct tape yeah when i broke my hand oh put some duct tape on it no, it's my hand. We're not putting duct tape on it. Men, people, come on. Granted, that's about all the stupid emergency room did. You know, as you can tell, I struggle closing my hand, but oh well. Life is, is, is hard. Okay, so we have these, you know, and then I don't even know if this lady likes distress. So I'm just going to lightly go around it, you know, just to kind of cover the, the whites. Oh, come on. There you go. <coughs> <coughs> All right, now, you know, y'all, I've eaten entirely too much processed sugar. I can tell because I have, my eyeball starts giving me trouble as far as vision goes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but John stressed me out and I've been eating crap. Okay, so we want it to be the length of our page and that's going to pretty much be it. Okay, now what I'm going to go do... Hmm. Well, I was going to do something, but now I'm kind of changing my mind. So I'm changing my mind. I know. This is this is definitely... I thought about it in my brain. Let's see if it's going to work for real. Let's just... I know I hate grungy in this up, but it needs some. <laughs> it's Candace. She's grungy. She needs some. All right, you know, I've got to see. I don't know if I'm going to be able to fix it. But I'm going to see if I can. Worst case, I'll cut another one out. But I definitely... Which way is it punching? This way. All right. I definitely need to see if I can get that little corner... Oh, wrong way. Corner off. Oh... Let's see if we can do it. Well, not really. You can't give somebody a gift that's a little wonky. 
Not a very good first impression now, is it? Okay, let's try this again. Let me just punch it. Oh, I think I have my my light situated wrong because there you go. I'm like, it's, it's blinded me. All right, that's good. That's close enough. I know I could put this on pause, huh? But I'm too lazy to stand up and do it. And, you know, as you can tell, I think I'm punching it the opposite direction. That might be some of my problem, too. <laughs> Any excuse but my own self, huh? Oh, my gosh. Okay. There. Much better. I'm happy. I can live with that. And I won't lose sleep over it. Like I was going to lose sleep over this one. Let me cut this off right now. So I know that this is not my friend. <laughs> oh. Alright now. Even though that one right there is cockeye. Alright, I'm going to put you on pause. I'm going to do this again. I know. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, fourth time's a charm. <sighs> I just couldn't have my circles not being round. I know. All right, let me just put a little inky on here. And then I'm going to try. I oh, know, I don't know. I don't know if this is going to work out, but we're going to see. All right. <coughs> let me see. I have, do I have thin? <coughs> Hello. Sorry, y'all. I'm trying to find my one eighth inch double sided tape. Okie dokie. And my chairs are rolling. I know, I still got a mess over here. So, we're going to cut this. I know, I'm wondering if I shouldn't keep it together. That's why I keep telling myself every day, you need to keep it together, Candace. You need to keep it together. Because I'm going to end up cutting this off here. So I don't need to worry about the. Jeez. Whatever that is. That fold up place. <laughs> All right. So I want to cut it at. <coughs> Two and seven eighths, which this still isn't going to work. I know I was trying not to cut the the top, but you know I don't really think it matters because I'm still got to open it to get into it. So let's just chop that off, <coughs> and we're going to go two and seven eighths. I'm making a belly band and that just happened to be like almost the very edge of here so when I peeled that little sticker off you know it did not show now it's stuck to me off am I filming yes I am okay <laughs> okay so we have that this is open here that's open there and it looks like well that's about perfect just where the bottom goes so let me cut that off you're in my way okay so I'm gonna cut it off I know you could use scissors but oh, y'all know I don't do well I need to get another trash bag back here I'm putting it in a gift sack <laughs> that's open okay so this is gonna be the sizes of our paper. I mean, just a hair, but you know. All right. It's going to open up now, now, now. It's going to be a belly band if you hadn't figured that out. So I'm going to take and put just a little piece of tape on there to hold it because, you know, we're going to we're going to sew it, too. So there you go. That's the whole thing. <laughs> Nothing special, huh? Oh. 
but getting it down here because see i was going to sew this together first and then i thought well why bother let's just sew it on here well i'm sure it's going to come back to haunt me so lord and if you hear somebody snoring that's just one of the beasts Yep, a damali. Oh, see, that's not even in the middle. Oh. Hold on, my chairs, my little, you know how your feet, I got six feet on there. And it's going, it's in the wrong, wrong thing. Okay, I know I'm thinking real hard now because I don't like this plan. So let's, let's line them up like here. I know, and I don't know what's going to guarantee me these are going to be straight either. Exactly. But we're going to, we're going to do our best. I'm sure I'll be <coughs> ticked off. It's not going to work. Um, <coughs> let's see. We have, well, that's going to show through there. I know, I'm thinking. If I had a piece of thread, Maybe. Who do I have that's wide enough? I've got this green, which even if you saw it through there would be okay. So let's see. I'm I'm about just to to ruin it. See, I knew it because I moved it. Darn it. And someone, myself, is saying, well, turn it over and, and, and mark it so you know which direction you're going. And the, my lazy self says, no. And then I'm going to be disappointed because it's not going to be straight. And then, well, should listen to myself. And But nope. Oops. See? That was another sign. <laughs> nope. All right. And just in case, if you see this behind there. It won't be so bad because it's green. Oh, not working, huh? God bless America. Okay. Back to here we go. All right. What not to do. That's exactly what this is. All right, let me see if I can line it up. Put it down the middle. So number, I think that was the number two. I know. Well. Oops. I mean, because the whole thing is when you put it on a piece of paper with some design. Oh, here, we'll use this. This is just hanging around. He's hanging around. Then you can see what's behind there, too, for when you do your tuck. I mean, that's the whole, you know, <coughs> thought behind it. Other than drive myself crazy. Okay, so we have that. Does that look straight? Answer is a uh, nope. Oh, I know. I need to move this over a little bit. I think this one needs to go over just a hair. But hey, this double stick tape works pretty good. <laughs> um, my top one needs to go over. All right, so we have that. Now... I am just going to put a little bit of this tape on here to hold it together so it doesn't move when I'm sewing. I know I don't know if my sewing machine is going to like it, but well, we're getting ready to find out. But if you don't want to, if you don't have a sewing machine, just use this on there and then put that on there because I'm telling you. A little is it it is a little hard with the eyeballs. Mm. 
Okay. So we have that. Now, see, I wanted to put this down the side and sew it, and this down the side and sew it. And then sew down the middle. So, you know, it's holding the, the what you dinky, the baggie together. So I'm going to go, I'm going to sew here, around here, and up here. Because I think I want to put some, or maybe do I want my things to hang out. I know, we're going to let it all hang out. And I'm wondering, is this going to be, should I trim this a little bit more? And I'm thinking, yes. <coughs> so... I know, I know, I know. I should have thought it through. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. I didn't think it through. I thought I saw a putty cat, so now I'm going to do it on three-fourths. And, you know, three-fourths with that being on my, my three-fourths for measurement. Because I think it was too much blue. We were singing Linda Ronstadt, Blue by you, you know. Okay, so now we just got to do some, a little dusting. I know, it's time again. Tomorrow's Wednesday, I got to dust. People, I'm so tired of cleaning. <laughs> oh, let's concrete this whole damn place. And astroturf the yard. I'll be all right then. I'll, I'll, I'll be just fine. Okay, so I'll be back. Let me go. Let me go do this, and then I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. So I stitched on here. I know I got a glue. Because I don't know. I was wondering if I... No, I don't want anything dangling there. And so... And then these are some of the blues that I had in my... Blue scrap bin. That I thought would be pretty. To put in there. Oh, well, somebody's just going to be upside down. Hopefully nobody will notice. <laughs> and then that and that. So, but I think it's going to be prettiest on, on here. I know, I don't even have room to put it. So let's just, well, let me, let me trim this side so we can fold it in half the right way. So we can get the whole, the full Monty, you know. Okay. Do, 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 do. I know I'm not gonna well you know I said I'm not gonna but I'm not gonna like get crazy on here because she's a writer but I am gonna do some so I mean who's fooling who but <laughs> I would challenge myself not to do a lot in here huh okay so we need to trim this one because it's the fattest of it and let me see what's this inside look like oh you're the fattest okay so we'll go right there and I should be good with not having any whites and then we'll put this on here like that I know we'll like I said we'll trim all those off and then this will be For a journaling card to go underneath there like that. And she can, you know, put any other little notes or whatever. You know, I'm going to have to put some stuff in there so she can understand <laughs> what these are all about. Oh, and, but that is definitely another way to use your acetate. So, you can make belly bands. And then what I did, because, you know, it was so hard to see on this clear plastic to line my stuff up. I just put some paper on there so I could see what the heck I was doing because, oh, yeah. Not going to lie. It was a little hard to see. I know y'all saw how hard it was. <laughs> like I said, I'm just making sure my, my threads get attached together and then you can see my little stuff on the back. But you're not going to see it because it's going to be 
glued to the thing, but now that I say that, well, we have to use um, Fabri-Tac. And it should do the plastic. It claims it does plastic, huh? It says, Bonds, Fabrics, Lace, Glues, Leathers, and Trims. Well, we're going to find out. Worst case, we'll have to put some washi on the back or something. But I think it will stay. Or I'll have to bring out... I'll have to bring out the ultimate glue. See? Adheres metals, plastics, glass, and more. So we might have to use that bad boy. But, anyway. Wrong, wrong, wrong scissors. But I am thinking... Did I get all that? Yes, I did. I am thinking... I know, you see that smoke... I don't like that on the plastic. You know, I still need to get all my grungy fingers off of there from my hand lotion. But, kind of reminds me of a pencil zipper pack, huh? <laughs> oh well. Now, what I was thinking, I was thinking about maybe putting some little um, flowers in here. Do I have, oh, he's behind all this crap. Let's see if I can get to it. Oh, lucky. It was meant to be. Oh, maybe not. Because my crap's a falling. Oh, dear Lord. Please, let me clean this hell all up. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, y'all. Okay, I was thinking of punching these little flowers. Where's some white? <laughs> I know I've got some scrap white somewhere. Oh, I got some of this, but that's not really a scrap, but. All right, let me see what I have over here. Mm -hmm. mm, I don't know, but you know, my stuff has other colors in it, so we might just have to bring in, there's a smaller piece of cream. Some other stuff. Oops. Like, let's see what this flower looks like. I might not even like it after all that drama. Oops. Yoo-hoo. There's my tweezers. Oh, no. Let me put it on here so it's not so... So, so, so. You know, I thought if we put a little couple flowers down here. Good Lord. Anyway, he's trying real hard for that double indemnity. That's all I can tell you. Because he's just doing some stupid stuff. You know, those steroids make you think you're Superman, and then your little body's like, oh my god, no. Okay, so that's too close to his friend. I don't know, this might be too, you know, too frilly doo-doo. But she had a hat on that had flowers, like, you know. And I saw, I thought, she would like, you know, she likes flowers. I know I gotta put oops, I gotta put dots in the middle too. And I could tell you right now these are gonna be too close for comfort. You 
got a spot. You got a spot. <laughs> I got an eight. Eight's not going to work. It's too even. Um, you know, but then if I put one here, well then, yeah. All right. So, let's get our polka dots out and see. See if I'm even close to where I need to be. Oh, yeah. I like those much better. I know the other thing is trying to find some dots that are kind of the same. Oh, that one looks pretty against that that one. I don't know if I like that blue. Oh, is that one? Hmm. Hey, how do I owe that? Okay, never mind. <laughs> I'm running mouth from mouth, that's why. Oh, we could put a little heart on here. No, it's white on white. I like that, that greeny color dot. All right. Oh, shoot. I need another one. Mm. Let me, that might be too close for comfort. Well, I kind of like that brown. <laughs> Who said they have to be kind of close? Oh, I don't, but I don't like that one. Yes, yeah, so whenever I punch holes, you know, I just keep adding them to this little thing here. Ooh, that's sparkle. That's Christmas. I thought I heard somebody in my tr in my a bag named Little Girl. Okay, we're gonna go with those. So let's put these up. I was gonna put some stuff in there and make it a shaker thingy, but I was like. Talk myself out of it real fast. <laughs> okay, so now let's see if we can ink and glue. So all I'm going to do is I'm just going to ink around here, and then well, I guess you know we got 25 minutes. What the heck? Oops. Um, just got to ink and stick. I know this is going to be tedious for you guys, but well, you know the whole thing. Yeah, it'd be interesting to see what kind of storms coming because I mean it is windy, 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 windy out there. I think I want it to go a long ways. Um. But yep, so this will be my, my first official Journal of Hope for this, this hospital. So it would be sweet. I know. <laughs> and I can hear Karen. You're putting too much into it already. I know, woman. I'm, I know, but well... You know, this is part of the challenge, too, on the little collaboration, I should say, not challenge. And so, you know, killing two birds with one stone. Oh, that was the wrong words to use. But anyway. Oh. Don't even get me started on anything else. 
let's just ink and glue ink and glue And I think of Ink of Stellar. <laughs> oh. Uh oh. Licking, please. That's the same, same punch. I can't have that. <laughs> so no, no. Let's do this one. It's a little different. Oh my goodness. But yep. The double-sided double, double -sided tape works great on here as far as your little acetate stuff, your little packaging. Like I said, I hope I'm um, thinking of as the same thing. You know, I had talked to Laura about, gave her some ideas about what she could do. And um, I was like, well, I can't use any of those ideas. I told her now. <laughs> so I had to think of something else. So, girl, you better use one of my ideas. Oh. Oops, wrong way. Pay attention, Candace. Pay attention. Don't be gawking. Do, 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 do. Gosh, I know it's too quiet. I guess John went back to bed. Oops, wrong way. Oh, I swear I'm waiting for this fireplace to just rip off one day while I'm down here because that thing is so loose outside. And like I said, every time it, it rains, I mean, wind comes, it just wiggle, 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 wiggle. Oh, I got my um, electric chainsaw. I got to gotta charge it. You know, it helps if you take it out of the trunk and actually charge. So after these next two or three days of rain, well, I guess I have to wait a couple more days for the stinking wood to dry so I can cut. But anyway, yeah. And then this weekend, our neighbor said they were going to come back. They were supposed to come back this past weekend, but they didn't. They're going to come this weekend because, you know, their, it was their five trees that fell off over the fence and took the fence down. Well, it took, turns, turns out, took out a 50-foot section of fence. And... Um, they're like, oh, well, you know, we didn't make it this weekend, but we're going to come this weekend. Do you have any extra fencing and stuff? I said, well, how much do you need? Because, I mean, what I saw, it wasn't that big, but it had grown into the tree. And when the tree fell, it just ripped them all down. So I'm going to, if it doesn't, if I can have some sunshine Friday, I need to drive up there with some big old bolt cutters and see if I can't cut some of the fencing off that's on the you know from the tree in the ground so they don't have to use so much of my good crap because it's not good fence that's up there you know so but anyway oh but there isn't that cute oh shoot i'm hoping this is running because i'm running my mouth and didn't have my phone plugged in hold on guys let me see if i can save this Jeez Louise, I hope so. Anyway, so there. There's our little acetate. Whoops. 
I know I'm not going to be able to not ink around here just a little bit. Oh, this lady, her name's Christy. This lady doesn't know she's going to be, she's going to be a light inker. <laughs> she's going to be a, a, a fan of light inking. But I will give her like the insight. That already has it on there, so it doesn't matter. Oh, and then I'm thinking when I put it in there, I might, you know, I really do need to trim that because you know, it's going to bother me. I think I'm going to dangle something from here, some beads or, or something. But let me trim right at the top off there. Oops, well, you know, I won't be able to put any beads or nothing on there because I'm getting ready to cut that off because it's going to hang. It's hanging past my comfort zone. Well, I mean, one hung on there. Good grief. I know I didn't get it because it's curled. I didn't get it all the way. But, yep, yeah, I think this is really cute. I know, and it makes a mess. <laughs> so, I think I'm going to go, no, because if I put it on there now, but then I'll forget that I'm putting it on here. So, I think I'm going to put it on and then let it set overnight with my, my special glue. Where'd my journal card go. Oh, let's, let's get one of the, I don't see them have to make her one like this and watercolor it. Like I said, I have to explain the whole concept to her <laughs> with some of these things, but I got to make it more of a writing journal for her because <coughs> she's a writer. All right. Well, shoot. There we go. All right. Well, I know it took a long Turked a long way around as usual, but hello, it's me. I hope I didn't lose any of it because I had forgot to plug my stinking phone up. So, but yeah, give that a try with your little acetate and make an acetate belly band. And like I said, if you want to go one step further, you can even put, you know, I might some Nuvo drops in the middle. Oh, no, I could pull in her color. Oh, or should I pull in some creamy color? Mm, I know. I put a rhinestone. Molly and Fergie. Stop. Anyway. So I think the next time when you see this, you'll see a dot in there because I think I'm going to do my dots. But if it was for you, for your personal thing, you could put rhinestones in the center too, but I, that might be too much bling. She didn't have a bling bling hat on. She just had like a regular little cap with not so wild on it. <clears throat> but all right, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for sharing some of your time with me. Thanks for sharing some of your day with me. Like, uh, I hope this is something a little different that you hadn't seen and um, give it a try. Like I said, it's really not that hard. The hardest part is trying to do it on a reflective surface. <laughs> <laughs> so don't anyway and if you don't have a sew machine you don't have to sew like I said just use some um, double-sided tape or if you have glue that you know that sticks to plastic like this um, you can glue it down so like I said I'm thinking I'm gonna go ahead and glue glue it on here and then let it dry and then put my new drop so I go whack whack and I'll show you then on the next one and you'll see it when we put it in the little journal so, um, lots of kisses, lots of love. Thank you to all my subbies. And, um, like I said, I'll put my little, um, hashtag in the link on here for Tommy's little co collaboration. And, um, y'all have a great day and give it a try. And we'll see you later. Bye, guys.